Automated workflows are only as strong as their weakest link, which is why the Now platform provides such an extensive array of options to connect to nearly any other system or data source. When it comes to interconnecting multiple ServiceNow instances, there are three capabilities designed for specific integration types. We offer instance data replication to facilitate duplication of entire tables across instances, and we provide the remote instance spoke to give you ad hoc control of instance interaction within Flow Designer. But what if you need to set up a stateful, bi-directional sync that requires alignment of only specific data elements between systems? This is where our third option, Remote Process Sync, comes into play. Remote Process Sync supports everything from simple to very complex multi-instance integration use cases and allows process owners to focus on business logic, not underlying data synchronization nuances. Using Remote Process Sync, you can create seamless, cross-instance workflows that enable a new level of business automation, whether you're connecting a variety of instances within your enterprise or interconnecting with your customers, partners, or vendors. Let's examine a situation where Remote Process Sync can help automate critical, multi-instance interactions and eliminate the need for months of custom integration effort. A service provider, JNCO, manages a wide range of third-party equipment, to efficiently scale operations, they have agreements with many of their vendors to handle physical repairs and replacements. One such vendor, Acme Inc., handles most of their servers and uses ServiceNow for incident management as well. The two companies have established an automated workflow to handle equipment repairs and replacement using Remote Process Sync. Whenever a component malfunction is detected by the service provider, an incident is raised. Should that component failure fall under the agreement with their vendor, the service provider team need only assign the vendor to the incident. With remote process sync in place, the service provider instance will send a predefined set of data to the vendor, triggering an automation that will handle the data appropriately. In this case, the vendor instance will use that info to create a new incident. The vendor team can then review the case and set it to in progress, which will then trigger a synchronization of the state field with the service provider's instance. As comments are added to the case, both instances are kept in sync with ordered parity. Finally, as each party performs their own unique closeout process, they can set the state to resolve independently at their own pace. This flexibility allows for tight coupling of specific aspects of business process while affording privacy and autonomy because each company has complete control over their own data structures. Let's watch this interaction from the agent's perspective. On the left, we have an agent from the service provider, JNCO, who has just assigned an incident regarding a server hard drive failure. She knows this falls under the agreement with their server vendor, Acme Inc., so she updates the assignment group accordingly and saves the incident, triggering a sync job that will send specific info to Acme Inc.'s instance. On the right, we have our agent from Acme Inc., who has just noticed a new incident created as a result of this remote process sync automation. To move things forward, Abel sets the state to in progress, which is then synchronized with the JNCO instance. Beth knows Abel will need a few details to address this situation, so she proactively provides him the applicable contract and hardware info. With this info in hand, Abel can proceed with the coordination of the hardware replacement. Without having to think twice, each company can work through their own workflows and seamlessly engage third parties across instance boundaries. Without remote process sync, this single effort would have required a significant degree of human interaction and would have taken orders of magnitude longer to resolve. Using remote process sync, both companies have a secure, reliable synchronization mechanism that provides near unlimited flexibility and consolidated administration of business process. Setting up remote process sync is straightforward, involving three primary activities performed on each instance. First, the remote connection will be configured, establishing trust between the two instances. Next, we configure the outbound sync. This is done by choosing the table, fields, and conditions that must be met before data is sent. That captured data can then be handled by a subflow and flow designer, allowing for precise, configurable conditional logic. Finally, we close the loop by configuring inbound sync logic, again accomplished using flows that enable flexible data transformation and mapping. This same process is then performed on the second instance. This robust framework provides a structured approach to establishing bi-directional sync in a manner that is both easy to set up and deeply customizable, resulting in value to the business much faster than integrations built with third-party solutions. The best part is, using this framework enables businesses to think in terms of business process, leaving the under-the-hood technical details like order delivery, downtime recovery, secure data transmission, and complex ETL operations in the capable hands of Remote Process Sync on the Now platform.
To learn more about Remote Process Sync, please refer to the official ServiceNow documentation.